is my flies open oh slightly oh sorry about that i feel like it wouldn't be a, a karen video if my flies weren't showing at some point hello it has been a while since i have done a thrifting kind of video and i thought sod it i'm going to do it right now i thought i'm going to kick off with showing you a video for spring on some of the pieces i'm really liking at the moment to wear specifically for spring season that's thrifted consignment just some of my favorite pieces to wear so i'm going to kick off with a click i know i keep clacking just clicking my fingers i'm actually going to start off with what i'm wearing little dresses i love them i love maxi dresses don't get me wrong and i still really do love them a lot but I have a thing at the moment, well, not even at the moment, I just have a thing for smaller, shorter dresses. Remember I used to wear them like years ago, I still love wearing ditzy tea dresses. So it's that same vibe. And I still love them to this day because they're so easy to wear when it gets warmer. I got this one and anyone who might remember this dress is actually from Realization Park. They don't even sell this dress anymore. It doesn't, it's sold out and I think it's like a couple of years ago now. Who remembers this star print dress? It was one of those dresses that I personally always loved and I always wish I got and I never pulled the trigger. But I did this time and I thrifted it and I got it on ThreadUp. Surprise, surprise. It's an online consignment and thrifting store and I've talked to you about ThreadUp before. This part of the video is in partnership with them. I have got things from ThreadUp now for three years and the reason is because of this. It's because I'm able to find really good pieces. It's all the names we know. Madewell, Levi's, oh my gosh, Realization Par, Reformation, you name it. Just go down the high street. They have it all on there. Plus they have designer things as well. And I did pick up one that is also from ThreadUp. So it's like the world is your oasis and it's such an easy way to A, save money. You can consign things as well. Plus it's sustainable as well. Before even sustainability was a thing now, I think like just shopping, thrifting, it's just such a good value way of just finding new pieces and they're pre-loved, but they're pieces that you know you're gonna love and you're gonna wear and you're saving some money as well. The estimated retail on this dress is $195 and I got it for the thread up price of $147.99. So it is a saving for me on something that A, is in my size and B, that is sold out. So I'm not paying the full price for it. I'm gonna show you some other pieces I got, but it's just so easy as well to shop on thread up because you can sort by brand, you can sort by size, you can sort by category, like if you're only looking for like dresses. So it's a really easy way to navigate the website as well, which is probably a lot easier than if you go into like a thrift shop because you can walk into those shops and you're like, oh my gosh, where do I begin? So there's an organization to it, plus you're just doing it at home, especially if you don't have a thrift shop in your area or you don't have really good ones in your area. And I do have a code for you as well, so stay tuned for that in a minute. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you in the cutaways how this looks so you can see. I love it, it is a perfect dress. I'm actually, funnily enough, I'm at the time of this making this video, I'm going to Mexico. By the time you watch this video, I will be back from Mexico, so you can see on Instagram to see all the pictures from there. But I'm bringing this dress with me. It is perfect for any vacation holiday i know later on in the year as well michael and i want to go away again to places where it's warm and also just in new york as well this is like the perfect dress to wear so um, i like the idea of just wearing it with like flat thong sandals uh, just a pair of wedge espadrilles that's also a classic way to wear it just a red lip as well like just like right here because it's like because it's black and just to have like a, oh, oh i can so see it anyway let me change into the next piece hold on it's so pretty i really really like it and i like that it's black as well because i feel like camisoles like this this doesn't date and it's something that you can just wear time and time again something like this i love the idea of wearing like a camisole with like a mensy kind of trout you know how i thrift all my men's suits and i get them from like vintage shops as well just imagine wearing like one of the trousers with this right i think that's gonna look so nice together that combination of wearing like masculine trousers and then you've got like a girly feminine you know what i'm talking about and the top like this and then you can even wear like the blazer the matching top so think about these things when you're styling anything like this and don't forget as well if you're not comfortable with having like all this skin out you can style this easily like over a t-shirt as well i've seen that done so that is the next piece i got from thread up i love it see this is why i'm shopping on there because you can get like pieces like this all right so i'm going to show you the next piece i got hang on another piece i got is this jumper i love this look at the color of it it's so nice and I'm wearing it with my Menzi thrifted, I've had these for a while, these men's trousers. The colors look so similar, don't they? Look at that kind of like this color here, this tan. 
taupey kind of color. I love this. I like the play, as you know, on something very long with something that's cropped. And that is what is happening here. So that's why I put this with that. This also I found on ThreadUp. The estimated retail is $36.99 and the ThreadUp price is $19.99. So just a smidge again under $20 mark. So if you've got this like kind of low slung, but I like the idea of breaking it so you can see the pant a bit more. I love that, there you go. Bam! So it's really cool and I like that it's a kind of boxy cut as well and this, you know I'm gonna wear this over dresses as well because it's gonna look perfect over long maxi dresses. I love to do that, that's one of my favorite things to do. If you follow me on Instagram, you know already I like to layer things like that. So this is a nice piece for the spring because as you know, the temperatures are like kind of like topsy-turvy all over the place. This is like the perfect piece just to put on and I think it's great. The color is what I was drawn to with this. So nice, look how it even goes over the shoulder. Just like that, it's so nice. Anyway, let me know if you try Thread Up. I'm gonna show the next piece, but this is, this is great. Wow, this jacket I found on Thread Up. Look at, look at the cut of this denim jacket. It is by Simon Miller. It's a boxy cut that drop shoulder cut has got to it. It's a little bit cropped as well on me and I love that subtle like orange contrasting stitch. You know how much I love contrasting stitching. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous jacket and I, I'm so glad I found it on thread up. I styled it over a vintage slip dress, but denim jackets is another thing that I gravitate to in the springtime. Perfect for this time of the year if you don't want to wear any other kind of jacket. A denim one is perfect because it's denim and the cut of this is superb. It is absolutely gorgeous. I'm loving that. I don't know if this is even coming across on camera. How nice the quality of this. There you go. Look at that. It's gorgeous. The estimated retail for this is $595. Bloody hell. And I got it for the thread up price of $465. It is still up there, but it's a lot less than what it originally estimates for. I just like the fact that I found it in my size and also just the fact that thread up carries designer pieces as well. The Zimmermans, the Simon Millers, the Marc Jacobs, they're also on there as well. Please do not sleep on thread up. So I'm really glad that I picked up this piece as well. I love the cut of it. This is an absolute must in a wardrobe for spring, hands down. Imagine a spring dinner and you're wearing this. It looks so good, just draped over your shoulders whilst you're sitting down eating or you're waiting to be sat at the table and you've got like your little bag with you. I am so glad that I found this on thread up. It's such a nice piece. And the last piece that I picked up is this lace tank top. And I thought this is perfect for when it's one of those days where you just want to wear something that's just very easy and simple to wear, especially like a pair of like denim jeans. And this is exactly how I imagine wearing this lace top. Is my flies open? Oh, slightly. Oh, sorry about that. I feel like it wouldn't be a, a Karen video if my flies weren't showing at some point. Anyway, so yeah, I like the look of just wearing it with just play, just like this. Perfect. Plain white. Look how, look how good this looks together. So the estimated retail on this Bisu Bisu is the brand. Sleeveless blouse is $54 and I got it for the thread up price of $19.99. So that is an absolute steal. But uh, this is exactly the way you're seeing it is how I'd want to wear it. Bum with a pair of like sneakers as well. And then just like baggy jeans. It could be white, it could be like blue jeans, it you know, depending on the wash that you want as well. But I like just the whole black and white and especially playing with proportions. Like this is fairly cropped. But I love the cut of this actually, this together. This looks really good anyway get 30 percent off your first order with thread up plus free shipping with my code karen go ahead it's one of those things i've been doing for a long time now and i will continue to do which is add in and mix in thrift and vintage into my pieces because that to me is the secret source of where you can really can put together a really cool outfit let me know what you get using the code all right i am done that is everything as far as what i got from thread up i'm going to show you the rest of the things i cannot wait for this to wear for this spring so another piece I can't wait to wear for the spring, I've already started wearing it because I just can't wait, is to just wear like light colored suits. Now these aren't actually meant to be together, but they're close enough color wise. So I kind of like it. So I've been like rocking it, but I'm looking for like that perfect, like it's actually a men's suit, like I bought them together. But this is actually from the Frankie shop, these trousers and these look so good on. I'll try and insert some cutaways. I think I've already worn this set. So I'll show you on the screen here. So the cut of this is superb from the Frankie shop. It's so nice. I love the way this top shows a little sliver of skin, by the way. I like that because it's cropped. Anyway, I digress. So this has been perfect. I wanted a light colored summer suit. It's such a cool Karen way to interpret 
spring always stick to your personal style and for me i love that kind of masculine edge so i think like a, a mensy vibe suit but in a light color is perfect this i got thrifted i think this was last year in one of my thrifting videos you saw when i got it it's great and it's just the gift that keeps on giving it says it's from banana republic i like the way this fits it looks so cool together they are like i said they're not identical see how they're close enough so it works out so i really like wearing these two together and also with like a skinny black belt right here that contrast looks like it's just chef's kiss so yeah i'm i'm loving wearing this concept for spring a spring light colored suit it's just not going to go anywhere i'm sure i will probably walk into a shop a vintage or consignment shop one of those places and i will find a suit where it already is that i'm manifesting it to happen so it probably will but cannot wait to wear this for spring oh, i've already started wearing it another one is this dress that i got I'm so proud of myself for coming up with this design this chartreuse color with navy and it's got like this swirl pan all over it and a lot of you have already started to get your orders for this dress already and you're tagging me in your stories and on your instagram posts wearing it thank you i designed it with me in mind when i come up with a design that i'm thinking of for clothing wise i'm thinking of myself what would i want to wear and i've already worn this i'll show you on the screen here i'm already starting to wear it for spring and it's great it's a button down shirt dress you can wear it completely open so just wear it like open just like a caftan type thing or you can wear it obviously as low as you want right a nice deep sexy v neck you know with maybe like a lace bra showing in black or even navy or even like a chartreuse yellow <gasps> that would look really nice actually that would look really nice it comes with its own belt but you can put your any belt you want with it i love it i like to wear it schoolboy style as i call it which is buttoned all the way up here and then oh, i'll show you in this cutaway so you can see what i mean i'm sorry i got to my own horn this dress gets so many compliments look at that that's going to screw with your eyes isn't it see the way it goes swirls like that and it swirls there that design is everything and it's got like full sleeves look at that and it's like a tight cuff it's so good you lot have been telling me that you get compliments when you wear it i get compliments when i wear it people ask me oh my god nice dress because it's so unusual you don't see prints like this and it looks so much more expensive than what it is i'm so proud of this and i cannot wait to wear this for spring color bright citrus warm colors this stunning bright orange i can't wait to wear this kelly green it's a short dress i also can't wait to wear it's just wearing these bright colors oh my god I can't, oh yellow as well like i said like be like the chartreuse dress i just showed you a moment ago but just also just in a solid color as well of yellow i've got another one right here a green shirt it's a color that is carried over from bottega from last year everyone knows under the house of daniel lee but it is moved on and it still is going strong and it's such a beautiful color like i said before my ms kelly that i got in and kelly green as well the point is i am loving wearing these particular colors it's such a strong powerful color comment below if you are looking forward to wearing this kind of bright green and the orange this category is one that i cannot wait to wear I could easily just over this or just wear it open over this and just have like a bralette here and just wear it like a shirt you know like an open shirt going to the beach right when it starts to get warmer this could be like an over shirt with your bikini underneath it and you just like go up it's like a loose cover-up so sticking with colors pastels as well that's another color combination i cannot wait to wear for spring for me i'm liking like this baby pink that i have and also this baby blue i just think these are so pretty these are thrifted men's shirts that i picked up you can wear these easily over like the dresses i love the idea of something like a long shirt and you wear a dress that is around the same length or just slightly longer than it right and this is just worn over it open and just got the sleeves uncuffed it's such an effortless vibe and just wear like thong lace-up sandals i think i say that term every single year thong lace-up sandals because it just looks so good these i can't wait again cover-ups as well as it gets warmer if you want like you're going on vacation this belted thin skinny belt if you want and then you can just wear like cycling shorts or you can just wear like a denim mini skirt the list of possibilities are endless when it comes to shirts like this but in this particular pastel hue i just think it's timeless i just oh it's so good so good 
Bag wise, I cannot wait to start wearing my vintage Fendi. This one I picked up from a vintage shop last summer, upstate New York. If you were subscribed, you already saw that video. And I remember, it was such a cute shop, remember? That married couple and they sold this to me. I thought it was so nice. Anyway, it is bigger than a Fendi baguette. And I actually like that because the Fendi baguette sometimes is a little bit too small for me. Vintage ones, not the newer Fendi baguettes because the newer ones are bigger than the vintage ones. Sticking with vintage here, I like the size of this one because look at the sides. You see how it's like a little bit fatter there at the base of it. I think that's really, really nice because it makes it really practical for me. And the reason I can't wait to wear this during the spring is because this strap is not as easy over like really thick coats in the winter time. If I'm wearing like a puffer or a duffel coat, you know, I'm not gonna wear this. I just, I'm not gonna wear this. It's not gonna happen. But as we're into spring, I'm wearing thinner jackets or I'm wearing like a leather trench or a suede trench, as you know. This with that, oh my God, yes, suede trenches, right? Oh my God, yes. What's the next thing I want to show you? Hold on, hold on. Wait, just, oh, oh my gosh, I need to calm down. I cannot wait and I've already started to wear my baguette, this vintage one, because like I said, I can start to wear it now because it's easier to wear over anything. And also it's got that 90s vibe because it's a vintage original Fendi piece. So it's really easy just to wear just over your shoulder like that. I love it, it's the perfect size. You know it's Fendi, but it doesn't feel like, oh my God, she's trying too hard because it's like an older school 90s vibe bag. It's great. It's the perfect shape and it's adjustable on the side so I can like make it a little bit shorter on me if I want and have it really tight up there or just have it loose like this, which is what I prefer like this. But this, oh, look at that. Oh! over like slip dresses, which I also can't wait to wear for spring. This is gold. All right, hang on, hang on. Listen, you can't tell me nothing. You can't tell me anything. You lot know about this gorgeous leather orange trench coat that I think I've had, it's either two or three years now, and I've loved it from the day I, I'm so glad. I remember the day I got it, how I almost didn't get it, because I thought, oh, was it too loud? But it's not, it's gorgeous. I am so glad that I got it. It's just so nice. It's so good. It's amazing. It's so good. And orange is like the color of this year at the moment. But I wasn't even thinking about that. I just loved it from the day I saw it three years ago. And I still love it to this day now. The perforation on it though, look at that, that. Look at that, yeah, see it. It's gorgeously made and the lining Goodness, the lining of it alone is um, superb. Oh, look at that together. <laughs> oh, this looks so good. Just be able to wear this together. I can't wait. This is what I can't wait to wear for spring. It's my colorful trench coats. These vintage ones are just um, insane. When you see one and it fits you right, just take it. Now ignore this black because I would not wear this with this. I've never worn, by the way, this orange trench with black. I just don't do it. So I just can't be bothered to take it off. I'm just gonna show you. So, so effortless. So effortless. The colors together. It's so nice, it's so pretty. The warmth of this brown with the orange. It's just so cool, but yeah. These are the things I can't wait to wear. That baguette, I could start to wear it with my, my trench coats and also with my slip dresses as well, which is another category that I can't wait to wear. Oh, I just can't, I just can't. I want to know in the comments, what are the things that you can't wait to wear for spring? But let me show you a couple of um, slip dresses I have and I, I can't wait to wear them. Okay, so I am a bit of a collector of slip dresses, vintage ones, and then we'll show you two that I really love. And I like them because it's not spaghetti thin straps, and that's what drew me to them. And they're beautiful in their own ways. This one is one of my absolute favorites. Some of you already know about this. I cannot wait to bust this out every single spring and summer, and I always do like clockwork because the work on it is absolutely, look at that, stunning and it ties at the back it's such a beautiful dress and it's long what can i say with flat sandals it's just a beautiful dress 
oh my gosh it's good i can't wait to wear it and this one i got from awoke vintage again same thing i love that it's a wider shoulder versus like a thin spaghetti strap it's got like a little pleating detail right in the center and then it also ties at the back these are the kind of pieces that makes me want to just get dressed for spring and summer and you can layer obviously like the denim simon miller denim jacket over these if you want or like a blue denim jacket over if you want or a men's vintage thrifted kind of blazer over if you want you know you understand and just drape it on your shoulder and then you can go out for like brunch you can go out for lunch you can go out for dinners switch to strappy heels kitten heels mules wedges flats flip-flops i mean come on with your baguette it looks so good these are, oh. i can't wait to wear these kind of things for spring i just can't vintage scarves hands down if you know me you know I, how much i wear these hands down i put these on every single year without fail i always want to wear these oh my gosh just a simple vintage scarf i just literally just bung this on really really fast vintage scarves are the best i wear them triangle style just tied at the back just like this without a blazer as well so it's just just simple just like that looks so good <gasps> i've done this loads of times i know i'm acting so surprised it just works every time that's why i love it so much these scarves are gems and whenever i go into vintage shops or if you could thrift them as well i look for these scarves because they're effortless they make anything look so individual the patterns on them they can come in so many different colors styles sizes as well i have them from vintage thrift all the way to hermes and i love all of them and i wear them all exactly the same way i'll show you as well in the cutaways sometimes i like to show them like just wall on my head as well with like big earrings i love that kind of vibe or just like this as a top it just reads as so effortless and time and time again i reach for vintage scarves and they never fail they just don't they stand the test of time that's all i can say and they're so easy to wear if it's still going to be a bit cooler you know i'm going to say you just drape or wear a blazer and you're good to go just a nice pair of cool sunglasses and that's it it's such a cool vibe to wear i love it I cannot say I love these enough. These are some of the things I just cannot wait to wear for spring. I just think it looks so pretty together. I'm just going to do a couple more and then that's it. But I just, oh. Tell me below what you cannot wait to wear for spring. If any of these things that I've shown is like what you can't wait to wear too. I think it's a bit of a given by now, but it deserves a category all by itself, which is my Christian Dior men's vintage coat, this trench coat. A lot of you have asked me about this trench, but it is one of those things I also can't wait to wear for spring. The colour of it is stunning. It is a size 36R, because a lot of you asked me what size do I have. Back venting, it is the details of it is incredible. This box pleat here, it's so beautifully made. I cannot stress that enough. The lining of it, it says Christian Dior, Monsieur Paris, New York. Dior doesn't even make them this way anymore. They've dropped off the word Christian for a start. This is a piece of history when you buy anything like this. Look around, guys. Check thread up. Check vintage shops. Consignment. You know, all of these places, right? Do not sleep on any of them. Nowhere is off limits when I'm shopping. I will go everywhere to look for certain things just to have a vibe and to have an aesthetic that i'm looking for that's the joy it's a mix of different things together so no introduction it's spring it's actually raining as we speak right now in new york i'm looking at the rain and it is coming down like cats and dogs it hasn't stopped it's been raining all day i haven't stepped out if i did i would be wearing this trench coat this makes me excited to step out when it's raining. It's like, that's the one thing, like if it's raining, what would you be excited to wear? And I would be excited to wear this. I don't mind when it rains, when I've got something like this, because it's such a nice piece. It's gorgeous. 36R men's, okay? I am five foot seven. I'll show you some pictures of what it looks like on me so you can get an idea of the fit and everything, but it is gorgeous. It is, it's just, the ultimate chef's kiss when I have this. I've already started to wear it again. I think I've had this, did I get it last year or was it the year before? Comment below, OG subscribers, did I get this last year? Was it last year or was it the year before? I actually can't remember. 
anyway tell me below because you probably know better than i do but spring you and me always it's so good okay sunglasses i cannot wait to wear these i've got a drawer full of sunglasses i love them they are like my little guilty pleasure because you can get them at any price point to match your budget these are one of my favorite pairs that i got from love day vintage they're so cool i'll put their instagram on the screen the woman who owns the store she has the most amazing taste in sunglasses as you can see because i got these from her and i have them in like a baby pink i'll try and show you on the screen when i was on holiday in anguilla and st bart's i brought these glasses with me and i wore them they're so cool right the shape of them it has like a kind of like a, a modern 60s kind of edge i just think they're so bad and it, look how it works with the scarf it plays out the colors these kind of sunglasses is look at that it just you see how sunglasses can completely change your look i love them i love them i just think they just make anything look so good again these are from love day i'm sure you already know how the power of sunglasses they help so much especially if you like want to hide behind your face with like no makeup days it's so badass and you can see me coming a mile away and i have like a scarf on this as a head scarf sometimes with long hair and I have these on, it's just such a cool look. Obviously I have these, these are my Loewe's. Again, ditto, I just love that kind of oversized look. A lot of you call them like 50s, was it, television screens? And I 100% agree with you, and that is what I love about them. I'll link everything in the description below, as well as the link to Thread Up. Please do not forget. And remember, get 30% off your first order with Thread Up, plus free shipping with my code, Karen. All right, you will thank me later when you try them. Honestly, they are, they are chef's kiss when it comes to thrifting online. The link is in the description box. That is everything, my loves. Everything you've seen in this video for spring. I want to know, as I've always said, what are you looking forward to wearing in the spring? I'm done. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you are into spring and you're looking out for some really cool spring inspo, just like I am. See me on Instagram and TikTok, all right? Take care, my loves. I will see you next week, Friday. In the meantime, I'll see you on Instagram and TikTok. This is so good. Oh my gosh, I love them. Sorry. I'm just, they're just so cool. Please let me know if you get any of these kind of glasses because I love them. All right, I'm gone. All right, bye. <laughs>